Ah, save room. Nemesis is not coming across as a constant premise, prem, uh, presence in this, like uh, the Tyrant was in the 2 remake, where he is unleashed on you and then you just have to continuously deal with him until you pass by the area that About he's in. This, he seems a little bit more set piece. Like, he appears at certain points. Ew. <laughs> he appears at certain points, and then he, we're past it now, and he won't be down here. I bet you he won't be down here, at least not for a little while. So I don't have to worry about him just showing up. Oh, Clearly there's something else down here. <laughs> oh, going this way. <laughs> Although, I don't have the key card. Meh, like battery pack. There's clearly power down here. Why do you need a battery pack to be installed? Ew. Two options. Yeah, I thought you would have to burn the clothes already. Look how nasty they are. It's another electric lock. Nope, this was a waste of time. If you downed the Nemesis in the original game, he did give you, um, you did get stuff off of him. And it was a bunch of items that you combined together to either get a better weapon or to improve your weapon or something like that. And it seems as though they are carrying that trend forward into this game. Motherfucker! They tell you not to flush these fucking things down the toilet! Okay. Another save room. They're everywhere. Oh. Okay. Oh, sweet. Hey, Kendo. Um, I'm a little uncomfortable with the idea of a regular-ass gun shop owner carrying grenade launchers. <laughs> Seems like kind of thing a normal person just shouldn't be carrying around. <laughs> I put the grenade launcher away because I didn't really have enough ammo for it. Although, it might be that they're intending me to use it on these catfish monsters. Catfish with legs. Oh shit, where was I supposed to go? Oh, open its mouth. That's when you shoot it. Don't waste ammo before its mouth opens. Sort of like the nemesis zombies, their face is shielded. Come at me, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, yep, she's dead. 
just swallowed her whole. Wow. Oh, I'm all the way back here. Alright, fine, fine. A map of the area. I guess in there is where I'm trying to get. Yeah, they give me the the grenade so I can grenade this fucking thing. And then uh finish it off with the gun, I guess. I wonder if it one shot her because she's in caution or if it's just like an enemy that's legitimately just supposed to fuck you up every time it touches you. Looks like I gotta combine something with that to make it work. Come at me, bro. Come on, open that, open that, open it. A little over dramatic, isn't it? Come on now. I hate, always hate these puzzles. If that's a puzzle. <laughs> Hello. Damn it. battery pack. I have to go back. I didn't, uh, carrying too much stuff. Hopefully none of those enemies respawned, so I don't have to worry about getting fucked up anymore. Just follow the monster corpses. Am I going the right way? Yeah. You know, there's a lot of water flow in here, considering that there's no rainstorm or anything going on. And if this is septic sewage, then who the hell's flushing their toilets right now? that red or about oh she's covered in it <laughs> and it's it's clearly 
a lot of shit because it's dark. I mean, runoff from a city, well, if it's coming through like that heavy, it's going to eventually turn clear. And it's just sort of pouring out of all of these <laughs> everywhere. Nastiest damn thing ever seen. Of course, they're reusing a lot of assets here. I mean, Resident Evil 2 Remake had a section in the sewer, and you spent a lot of time running through there. And even if it's not like the same environment that they're reusing, they're definitely reusing a lot of the same like textures and stuff. Today you hatched. Oh, fuck, what? Psycho. Ah, I'm out of space again that fucking quick. That fucking quick. Come at me, bro. Oh, not dead. A little formulaic, these encounters. back here. Ah, fuck. Alright, fine. Back to the save room. Kind of don't want to ever get rid of the lockpick. Or the knife, because it seems to be eternally useful. Not so much in fighting zombies, but in opening boxes. And the lockpick, I mean, I'm constantly running across things that need the, need the lockpick for. Oh, I heard a noise. Pretty sure that wasn't in real life. <laughs> It says there's something in this room. I should move when I'm in here closer to the edge. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, man. Here I go again. <laughs> I know backtracking is the name of the game in Resident Evil. But usually you'd backtrack based on, like, oh, well, okay, now I picked up this item, so I need to run across this area I have already been in order to... To access the next area or to unlock this door to do something along those lines. You know what? Fine. Knife is gone. Well, you know what? No. This seems crazy, but I'm going to get rid of the pistol rounds and bring the knife back out. I got 30, 33 rounds in this thing. Hopefully, that'll hold me to the next point where I. I mean, it doesn't seem like there are a lot of zombies down here, so the pistol may not be required anyhow.
I'm not deep enough in the game yet to... I mean, there's always a point in the Resident Evil games where the pistol just stops being useful. And you put it away and, you don't, and you're not going to use it again. But usually it's pretty deep in the game and it's when... After you've played it before and you know where is... Uh, where you're... Damn it, look, I gave... See, that's why I didn't put away the knife. Yeah. Okay. Cleared this area out. Got my battery. But yeah, eventually you'll put the pistol away. But I'm, I don't feel like I'm deep enough in the game. I haven't even reached the police station. I mean, none of that stuff has happened. You bitch. Come on. Stupid-ass monster. Wonder why they never implemented a stamina system in this game, or this series, where you, uh, You have to worry about your characters getting tired while running. That was a one-time use item. Okay. I can't take it out once the door is unlocked. <laughs> I guess if I get it like right in the middle of in the middle of the mouth, I get a critical shot. See, now I don't have a battery for this. Can I take that battery out? Seems like, I mean, realistically, once the thing was unlocked, why wouldn't you be able to take the battery out? Move it. Oh, it's a backtracking door. Ah, see, there we go. it locks. That motherfucker, it locks. Oh. <laughs> Up. Oh, look at that. Sweet. One thing I was complaining about the past few minutes. Inventory space. It's like it heard me. Must have heard me. Just enough space to carry this now. I'm running low on shotgun ammo. I hope there's not a lot more of those things. I have enough ammo to take out like one more. Oh, it's a backtracking ladder. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. This is the exit. Yeah, that was the exit. Or, no. That's another backtracker. Carlos, can you hear me now? Jill. Oh, thank God. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm alive. I lost him. I have a question. How did she know that Nemesis was after her? Of course it is. It was hunting down the Stars members. And that was made obvious. Oh, shit. <laughs> I 
Get off of your fucker. That'll keep him out. Let me save here just so I can have save spots at different parts of the game. When I go to make a trailer, something I'm going to want to have. I'm going to have to uh, do something about my headphones. The batteries are, are dying. 